we are. TC Tech back out again on this pasture field here, as you can see. Um, it is the end of May, or coming towards the end of May. So most pasture fields are in two foot high grass. I'll put some footage on uh, later of the grass in most of the other fields on this particular permission. Uh, this field and the ones around it look like they've been kept uh, pretty short by the cows which are wandering around. So I'll have to keep an eye on those today. Make sure they don't get too close or too friendly, which they can do on occasion. Um, we are waiting for the Rutus Versa to arrive, so watch the channel for a bunch of Versa clips, both out in the field and instructional videos on the settings uh, and those sort of things. Uh, in the meantime, like I said, out with the legend today on this field. Let's see what we find. And first decent signal down here. Potentially double signal, 42, 43, see what that is, and that decent signal is out in the hole, oh sorry, it's still in the hole, and I just realised I forgot on my gloves today, and they're back in the car, where I have about four pairs, the car is too far away from me, I have to go into, so, I'm gonna... Global list today, I don't recommend it under normal circumstances. I wouldn't, be. I think we've got a bit of trash here, like that tin can or something, so we will be careful pulling it out. Yep, use the signal tin can. And I didn't film this one uh, coming out because it was uh, it's another one where the signal was 43, so it was another piece of uh, tin can coming up because uh, I'm already on three bits of tin can. But when I dug it up, and uh, I guess this is why you, you should never pay attention just to the target ID and knock things out. We have uh, what looks like something that's been used on maybe bridal wear or something like that. Uh, it's got some studs on the back, so probably be pressed into leather. It looks like it's in the shape of uh, a barrel. I wonder if this has been like on a, a dray horse second beer and ale to a pub. There is um, a ruined. Uh, a very large ruined building about three fields away from here um, rumour is that was an old uh, pub probably a couple hundred years ago so I wonder if they're connected and I'm also next to uh, Country Lane just there as well so they could be uh, all connected there you go first find of the day next up in a very solid 33 on the legend is this little thing i don't really know what it is it looks like it's been attached to something see the patterning on it it's uh definitely got a design but it's got a pressed copper i'm gonna guess so i'm not sure what it's been attached to. i think here is where it's broken off something the end of a decorative spoon handle, but it's far too thin for anything like that. Any ideas? Put it in the uh, comments. And next signal is in the hole, taking a bit of soil out. Very stony, the soil up here, because quarrying a lot of it. In here. Somewhere. Let's see what we know. Still in the hole. Yep, so telltale sign of what looks like a coin on a button. It looks like a coin. A lot of um, three decimals on this particular permission. Looks like a farthing or a half penny. I'm not sure if I can get that cleaned easily because no gloves on. Yep, coin. First coin of the day, I'll clean that up later to work out what it is. Looks like a half penny though. Next up is the first button of the day. Looking down there about four inches down. Nothing's anything deeper than four inches really due to the uh, bedrock being only that far down. So yeah, little, looks like it was gilded at some point. Button. Very next hole we have another button. Little. 
bit of a shank on the back while we're broken. But yeah, still managed to it that outfit. And next up is in the hole, still. Very clear, 43, 44. Let's see what we get. Looks like a conical something that's been flattened at some point. Coppery. Don't think that particularly got any edge to it. We are right under. Let's just hit pylon. Thing doesn't do well with the interference. Not really reacting too much with it. Uh, and under said electricity hit pylon. We've had one of these. And I say one of these, actually it's my third in the last five minutes. So I have a feeling these are somehow connected with what's on the electricity pylon. When they've been installing or whatever, they've dropped a bunch of them. So, third one of those. And next up, I just flicked the clod out and I can see what looks like the side of the coin on the button just there. It looks like we do have our second of the day. This looks like a George the sixth ship half penny. Nice. There you go. George the sixth ship half penny. 